Are you a mom moving to Spokane or new to the area and in desperate need of friendship? If you answered yes to either of these questions, cheer up because I know what it feels like to be new to town all too well. In this video, I will share a few excellent ways to start building community so that you can stop feeling lonely and start feeling connected as soon as possible. For those of you that don't know me, I'm Desiree Renshaw, a mother, a transplant to Spokane, and a top producing realtor. I have moved a lot in my life, but when I moved to Spokane, the transition was more difficult than others I have had. But I worked hard to meet people and grow my diverse world of friendship. So if you need some ideas to create connection, you have come to the right place. Make sure to watch to the end so that you don't miss a single detail. I recommend trying all of the recommendations. All right, let's get started. Have you heard of Nurture Lactation? I hold this business close to my heart for many reasons. First, I believe in what this business offers, but the owner is also a past client and the sister to my beloved assistant, Alyssa. The lactation support is incredible and essential to our community. However, they offer even more than that. My words simply cannot do it justice. Check out their website for upcoming events and mom group gatherings. They are committed to establishing community and building friendships. I wish Nurture Lactation had been around when I had my babies because I needed it. Co-op and moms. I have been involved in co-op for almost four years now, ever since Jude was an infant. Co-op is a place for parents and children to learn and grow together. There's an infant, toddler one, and toddler two class. Each class meets once per week. The friendships that I have made at co-op have been life-changing and all with moms in similar stages with their kids. Mops meets once per month and you are assigned to one table with a table lead, mentor mom, and the same group of ladies each time. There are many events outside of this monthly meeting and each table gets together pretty regularly. The meetings are just for the moms, so childcare is provided and allows moms a breather and adult time to connect. Mom and me groups such as mom and me yoga, mom and me gymnastics, art are all great options. Some of my co-op mom friends joined Hackett Baby Spokane when they moved here and loved it. Their mission is beautiful with a commitment to families to connect with nature and find a love for the outdoors. Everyone is welcome. If you crave connection, nature, and physical activity, you should definitely check out this group. Book clubs. When I moved to Spokane, I joined two book clubs. I am so glad that I did because I am still great friends with all of the ladies, even though both clubs have since fizzled out. You should check out Auntie's Bookstore. They are local and offer six different book clubs to appeal to a variety of interests. Some are still provided virtually and others are now in person. Even the virtual book clubs can be the segue to setting up a friend date with someone who has similar interests. Running groups. There are more running clubs than I can list. Head over to the Inlander for a comprehensive list so that you can find the right fit for you. However, the Manitou Park Running Club and the Flying Irish are two honorable mentions. If you are an intermediate or advanced runner, I am not, and you prefer a morning run, you should look into the Manitou Park Running Club. They meet on Saturdays at 8 a.m., followed by coffee and socializing at the lovely and local Rockwood Bakery. The Flying Irish meet every Thursday night and typically have dinner and drinks afterward. When my younger sister moved to Spokane for about a year, she found so much joy and connection running on Thursday nights with the Flying Irish. Although there are many more fun ideas to list, my final idea is athletic clubs. There are classes at the larger gyms, but these days there are so many fantastic smaller studios geared toward building community. I am a massive fan of Farm Girl Fit and Aero Fitness. These gyms have incredible owners, super fun workouts, and a community built around relationships. You can even bring your kids. I recently started working out at Aero Fitness and am blown away by what they have created. Check them out for yourself. 
And now that you have a few fun ideas on ways to make friends, I hope you feel excited and your lonely days are soon behind you. For more fun information on Spokane, check out some of my other videos. And if you are local, please list some of your favorite ideas below. Again, my name is Desiree Renshaw. If you have any questions or need someone to help with your transition, please reach out through DesireeRenshaw.com.